Alright, let's do this chapter six. We have to do something about Veronica's execution. We can't allow it. We need to go save her. Do you have a plan, Zacharias? The keep she's being held in is near impregnable. It guards are extremely loyal to the Empire as well. They will not surrender easily. With the hero's strength, however, we may be able to defeat them. But they will fight till the last. A direct assault could result in deaths of scores upon scores of Emblean soldiers. We'll have to send in a special unit. No, sneaking in is not a possibility. The fortifications are airtight. Nothing can slip through. It wouldn't matter who you were to send. They would not return. Then there's no way to save her? There is one possibility. It will require me to act on my own for a while yet, though, unfortunately. I'm sorry, Alphonse. But I must ask you to take the fight to the Curse Directive in the meantime. So then, do you have a plan? I do. I plan to save my sister. They do not let up. They must plan to do everything they can to keep us from reaching Princess Veronica. We have to trust Zacharias knows what he's doing and that he can save the princess. Right now, though, we still got these defenses to contend with. Fight them all. From there, from there, from there. Good, 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 go, 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 go. Nice. There we go. Leticia must be up to something. I beg your pardon? Oh, I have Oh, you haven't heard? There are rumors going around. Princess Veronica is innocent, they say. It's all a conspiracy against her. Leticia must be up to something, or so they say. What drivel. The goths of a fools is none of my concern. And your concern is none of mine. But say this gossip is perhaps not far from the truth. What then? Then it would be more than gossip, wouldn't it? But we need we we need not worry about that, and I'll tell you why. The truth is simply the lie that everyone continues to believe. No matter what kind of kind of gossip my foes may spread, I will overwhelm them with the story of my choosing. I hold the levers that determine the truth. So you do have a plan, then more or less. How reassuring. I have spies embedded across the whole whole of the Empire. They will spread the narrative of Veronica's villainy. I will put each and every one of them into action. I will not fail. Propaganda and manipulation are my specialties. I cannot be threatened by rumors among the peasantry. Lovely. Then I suppose there's nothing to worry about then. Is there my future emperor? Oh, that bitch is as good as dead. Right, Batman? Yeah. This pendant is a memento. I carry it always. Yeah, that's right, boy. My little Veronica, how have you been? You must be hungry, poor thing. I haven't heard you eat not eaten for days, not even a drop of water. Of course, you haven't been given any given anything. When I give an order, I am obeyed. Your execution will take place on the day after tomorrow. It's nearly here. The anticipation must be unbearable. Care to show what's on your mind? You look like you have something you want to say. Do go on, sissy. What do you want from me? What, is it not clear yet? Everything! I want to take everything from you. Your wealth, your power, your life, everything you have. And after your execution, I'll take your mother's seat on the Imperial Throne as well. And what then? Pardon? You become Emperor, and then what will you do as Emperor? 
Ooh. I used to never consider the impact people have on the Empire, but someone changed my mind. They say a ruler's purpose is what's service of their people, that I was selfish for behaving otherwise. I have spent more time with Prince Alphonse and Princess Sharina than I may care to admit. I believe they always have the needs of their people at heart. I want it to be more like that. Sissy, what do you think? Spare me. Even now, pitiful as you are, you still dare to condescend to, condescend to me, as if you're my better. Guards, the prisoner requires a lashing. Do not stop until you wiped all defiance from her face. Now! Do what you want with me. Just treat my people well. <laughs> oh man, those people are really gonna be fucking pissed off when they find out their fucking princess is dead. Their ruler is dead. Clearly, Leticia has not heard of the Revolutionary Wharf. Clearly. Clearly, she has not heard of the Revolutionary War. And apparently she's just spoiled of a fucking brat. What, because you don't have anything? I mean, yeah, I get it. I You're already fucking royalty, what more could you want? Dude, you have the fucking Order of Heroes, and you still want more smoke? My god damn! Bitch! I mean, I got my channel, I got my family, I have my job at the restaurant, what more do I fucking need? I need nothing more. Maybe I want a few more games, but that's because I want to have a few more games. It's not greedy, I just kind of want a few more games. But I try to play every game that I have, and I try to do everything that I want to do. And we're grateful for the games that we get. And I'm going to try to be better. And we use them to the very last drop. The rumors aren't out of your control, are they, Leticia? I'm perfectly aware of the various opinions passed among the Empire's ignorant masses. Leticia or Veronica, which is telling the truth. At the moment, six out of ten people believe my side of things. Well, well, impressive. Spread enough lies, and the truth is whatever you want to be, just like you said. Ooh. Something wrong? The propaganda we've been putting out should have been, had a greater impact on swaying the public. Our tactics were calculated. Dissent should be disappearing, and yet, I'm barely holding on to the con to control of the narrative. Why do you do so many still have faith in Veronica? These simpletons. Is there nothing that can make them see the truth? Quite the con quandary. I simply need to reinforce Veronica's criminal crim criminality, embroil her in even more scandal. Whatever it takes. I control the truth in Embla, and now I will prove it to you, little Veronica. Okay, sure, but what happens to the people? Yeah, when they start revolting and what happens? throwing stones at your head. You gonna take care of them? No, you're not, you dumb bitch. You just... Oh, so you just want the throne. Okay. You so, you know better than our current president, Joe Biden. Exactly. Joe Biden is just a dumbass. I don't think he knows what's going on. I believe that man has no idea what the fuck he's even doing. He's fucking senile as shit. And me and Zalir agreed. No president should- they should have a fucking Age mental rule. test, a mental test, oh, absolutely. and a fucking- there should be an age gap. 50 should the be- thing I've been like seeing. 60 to 50 should be the highest of age of the president, not fucking 70 and 80. <laughs> oh man, I mean corruption is never gonna end until someone does something about it, but what happens then? The heroes become God, corrupt, youngest, they become the villains. Our youngest president that we had in the last... John F. Kennedy was the last one. Not even, no, you're wrong. Obama was one of the youngest presidents we've had. Yes, but he became older. Yes, but he was one of the youngest presidents we've had. Your Highness. He left when he turned 40, or like 50. Um, then we got Trump, which is in his 70s. Who's there? And Biden, which is in Please his 70s, 80s. I hope you can forgive the humble quality of this food and drink. Even those con con condemned to death deserve a last meal. Oh, I cannot take it. Leticia told me about the order she gives. She finds out you did this, she will have you punished. I won't let that happen for my sake. Your Highness. The Empire is divided. The people do not know who between you and Leticia is the one side of truth. The citizenry, even we soldiers, we don't know what to do. Please, Your Highness. You didn't really commit all those horrible acts, did you? I need to know. No, I would not act against my own people. Then it is as we feared. Wait. 
Do you not be do not be satisfied with my answer alone. Go t to Leticia. Ask her for truth as well. You want me to ask Director Leticia? I don't understand. I may be lying as far as you know, trying to play you for a fool. Do not be swayed to take sides so easily. Remember that after my execution, take no one at their word. Learn all you can before deciding for yourself. Embla's future will not be determined by royals like me or like Leticia. It will be the people of Embla who decide its fate. Damn. That was a that is a quote right there. Uh hello Astrid. That's the high school quote. The day we've mm -hmm. all been waiting for is finally here. How will you celebrate Veronica's death? Very soon now, when the sun reaches its apex, the execution will commence. Alphonse, can Zacharias stop her? Don't worry, I'm certain Zacharias has a plan. If you wish to convey any last messages to Veronica, now is the time. I will arrange to have her head sent to you. But I don't think she will be very talkative. How can you say such things? You're terrible. We're killing her. We're killing this bitch. Wow, decapitating heads. That doesn't sound like someone who tells That's the what truth. what they did. That's what they did. Oh, man, oh, man. It's like, do you don't remember in the shield hero they are going to do to get decapitate the bitch? Yeah, man, no. But the shield hero is a fucking Chad, and he allowed them to live? Even though she went to try and kill this guy a second fucking time, even though he spared her life? Yeah, I know. What a bitch! <laughs> Nah, she just want, doesn't want to be proven right. She doesn't want to be proven wrong. Where to today? It sucks that the own person that she was working for betrayed her. Yeah. Oh, I was talking about Shield Hero, by the way, guys, if you don't know. I, I, I'm i pretty much caught up on Shield Hero. Suppose we can withdraw. But do, do know that I've won here, even so. You understand, don't you, Prince Alphonse? You've lost. While you've been preoccupied with us here, Veronica's execution has just been completed. It is too bad we had to miss it. Regardless as promised, you can expect to have Veronica's head delivered to you in short order. Direct like Tissy, I have to report. The princess has been removed from her cell and, and... The next words out of your mouth had better be about that execution I perceived without incident. The guards released the princess. They let her go! I beg your pardon? Oh, shit. What is the meaning of... They freed her? Treachery! I ordered an execution! One simple execution! How is this possible? Are these fool soldiers truly so completely useless? The error was on your part, not theirs, Leticia. You! You lie well, Leticia. And you lie enough to conceal the truth and even undo it. Your mistake was thinking those lies would never catch up to you. That you, you could simply dictate. The more lies you tell to disguise the true nature of things, the more fragile the facade becomes. He's got a point. The further from the truth, the easier the lie is to strip, strip away. away. With those falsehoods gone, you are exposed. What are you suggesting? You spread yourself too thin, trying to cover up the truth. You needed to involve people outside of your inner circle. Surely you knew they weren't all perfectly loyal. Some even told me whatever I wanted to know in full view of the other soldiers. I see. Of course they could offer me no proof of what they told me, which I'm sure was part of your plan. But once the roots of doubt take hold of the heart, it is a difficult weed to remove indeed. Who is in the right? Veronica or Leticia? Even the prison guards were unsure. But they all soon realized the truth, and in their own way, I might add. Or how dare you! Veronica will soon arrive, joined by the forces from the prison keep. Hurry away if you want any hope of escape. You, you, I will not forget this. I will make you regret it. Zacharias! Thank you, Zacharias. It seems you've managed to come to our rescue once again. I should be the one thanking you, but matters are not settled yet. The Imperial forces are divi divided between Veronica and Leticia. The fight is not over yet. Fuck, so now we gotta fucking fight the bitch. Seems to be. The bitch.